So I'll fix it grant here. So today's video kinda look a bit different from what we usually make. Um but I have to do this because this look a guy we call himself a plumber up on YouTube. Him kinda this. You know, him, him put up him right in the comment section kinda like a disrespect and thing. Or uh, maybe him just not know the better, one or the other. But it's a guy we always put up videos and him take them back down. I guess when somebody comment on it and tell him say do it wrong, him take it back down. A whole heap of foolish video this guy put up. And him end up take them down back when him find out say them foolish, right? So me kind of reach out to him one at a time and to make him know say listen, me and you can link up together, and when you make them video, you just send it to me, and me see if it's good before you put them out. You know it's like a team thing. Me me, me, me don't want to do with him, but me find out say him don't want to reach out. Him don't want to reach out. Him rather you criticize it and then him take it down, right? Whole heap of foolishness. If you have been watching them them them, I think I only two away I do it uh, Jamaica yeah. But when I tell us, hey man, I a foolishness, man, the total foolishness. In, in the one with a toilet, foolishness. In the one with a faucet. Tell us, say you don't have to buy a kitchen faucet. You can use two of these things and, and make your own faucet. Foolishness to the core. And take down, the, and take down that video and take down another one when you do a plumbing thing where foolishness. Me make a video after of that, but me not, me never say anything about him channel. I'm going to watch this to the end, you know. Just watch a video to the end. It kind of look a bit long, but just bear with me and watch it, right? So him um him take down most of the video them. So I put up a video with a toilet. Where my install a toilet and put on the flange and all that. Alright, if you've been following my videos, you know what I mean. I when I first made in a Jamaica talk about the flange them. Cause me learn my thing in America. I live in America for over 30 years. So I know them are something. Here. Me I do plumbing for America. Flange you have to put on a flange, right? Jamaica them put on two screw and put on toilet. Them screw that go rat now and that. Yeah, yeah. But now I go through all of that right now. But this guy kind of write me something in the comment section for my video I do yesterday and he made me drive all the way come down here so from me pen. All the way come down here so. Right? Me de far. Right? So, just to come show him say yo, a foolish is my talk, right? So, if you, have, if you have, haven't checked out the video we make yesterday, just check it out. Um, the one where I show you the bypass and all that. So, if you all haven't checked it out, check it out. And I'm going to show you right now, so this guy is talking about a whole heap of foolishness. Right? So I walk back to the house and so I do the, um, the tank and the thing. So this guy tell me, say, um, when we do the bypass thing, now I'm going to work and all these type of things and all these things. So I just go to um, check out because the people call me and tell me say them tank overflow last night, right? And this man tell me say this thing when we do now I go work and something about check valve and all these type of things check valve too far apart and all these things all right you can see the people them having water problem them have all type of water in a jug and all them something then water no water and they both for a while so all right this is my work and if you walk around and look at most of the house in Jamaica then put one check valve right off here, so. right off somewhere. Here, so, me not do that. Me put my check valve up there by the tank. Then put the check valve, the non returning valve right down here, so on the wall, right? And it work. The issue is not where you place your check valve. That's not the issue. The issue is the type of check valve you use. So, right there, so him not have no sense. Alright? So, now I'll go in and I'll talk to the. Hello? Yeah. Hello, morning. Yeah, morning. The day. All right, so, how long you have no water? How long you have no water in the tank? Mm, from, 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 from two, almost a month now. Almost a month you have no water in the tank. Because mm -hmm. the water pressure is very low. Mm -hmm. All right, so, yesterday I come and I uh, tell us I put a something upon it, uh, I bypass it, and I also tell us your tank is going to run over, right? Exactly, so. And what happened? When I woke this morning, it was running like river. All right, so tank run over. All right, so somebody write me on my channel and them say about um, the thing when I do a uh, foolishness and I take no money by doing foolishness. I should tell you to buy a pump instead, instead of doing um, doing the bypass. Well, the bypass work for me this morning when I wake up. Yeah, water pressure here now and it's running in and out. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. It works for me. Mm -hmm. It didn't cost me a cent. Yeah, me, did I charge you? It didn't cost me a cent. Alright. So people, when you hear that, 
I don't charge the people them nothing for come put on the bypass on it because I me, me see the issue where I want to say people them, you know. I don't to mention no pump when I say they don't need no pump, you know. And, um, and everybody can afford a pump right now. So listen, I'll take a look. i take a look upstairs and see where I'm going. Sorry me for walk away from the lady like that. But this guy here kind of have me hot. Kind of have me hot, you know what I mean? Shouldn't make somebody piss me off like this here, but him do it. So I climb a ladder. I climb a ladder go upstairs. Yeah. So I'm upstairs, up on the decking. And listen, people, I don't want to feel like me feel like me are the best plumber in the world. No, I'm not the best plumber in the world. I learn still. Still learning. Right? Every day I live and learn. Thankful. Can you hear it? Full to the brim. Alright. And this is the bypass. So this is what it look like. So the guy is saying I work, right? Then there's another thing him say about this this year. Him saying that the distance away from here to here, I got cars this for not open. People, as I'm showing the downstairs, so all the people put it downstairs and it still work. So you don't have nothing to do with the distance where you're there if you put it here. So first of all, the reason why I didn't put it right here is because I was planning on putting a lock off right here. So. Right? I was planning on putting a lock off right here. Alright, so it no matter which way you put this. As what I said before, what matter is the type of check valve where you put on it. So yesterday when we come here. So yesterday when we come here, water the only day right here so. Right? So one, two. When we cut this, when we cut the line, water run out. So no matter this check valve right here, so we make water run out until it get to the very bottom till it can't come out no more. So we might talk nonsense. Foolishness. Right? I shouldn't even indulge myself in a, a, a fool like that because the person obviously, obviously don't know anything about plumbing. If him didn't know, he would have known say yo, if you use the right check valve, the water will exit the tank. You also have some check valve where you have a flap in it. You no matter how much water in the tank, it will run out. Right? So I'm a fool. No, I'm no sense. No matter where you put the check valve, once the water pressure is good enough to open the check valve, the water go run out. Him say you gotta have quarter tank, a water left in your tank. If you don't place the check valve at the correct place, foolishness. Water could end up weird on you so. Once you can end, enter through here, it will run out through the check valve. If you have a correct check valve. So, see, the people them no water. The lady no water when she come from foreign in the tank. And the one time we do the bypass. The tank full. It can be just something happen where the water pressure comes strong last night or something. Why she have water like this? But as when me say, me do the bypass and water. And even, even if you're correct, even if you're correct, say water after the water get to a certain point, it will go to it will send back pressure where the water now go enter. Even if you're correct, it's still better than it down here, so. Than it, it's better when you're up here, so than it down there, so down. So, you still don't make no sense. The people in tell us they can't afford a pump. People them just want some water. So, trust me. People listen, sometimes when I listen to some people, you know, as I said before, I check out this person's channel, and sometimes I read some of the comments them. Just like other people read my comments them. I may tell you say yo. Some people say yes plumber you are the best. And yo, yes plumber you are good and thing. And I laugh. Because when you see the foolings you see with, this, with this guy do. One thing I can say about this guy. Right. Since him want to talk about me them way there. And guess what. I now delete your comment. Your comment where you put there. I now delete it. How many times I comment and you delete it. You delete all of the comment them way. Not only me send. Other people send it and you delete it. I don't delete your comment. People can try them things for themselves. If the water pressure is low, 
Just go ahead and bypass the check valve and watch what's, what's going to happen. Watch what's going to happen. Right? And the check valve also. Just let me tell you a while ago. Tell you all a while ago. The check valve. Um, it doesn't matter where you put it. Once the check valve is a good check valve, it will let out water until the tank is empty. Trust me upon that. Try it for yourself. So, I am way far away from my home right about now. Just to come, come, correct that guy. Alright? So, more to come.